Hi, I'm Elizabeth, Jimmy's wife and partner at Lamb Sign Company. I want to show you how we arrive at a finished painting of a logo. Sometimes we feel that a painted logo is better than a digital print. This vinyl stencil was cut on our plotter. This line has already been painted and now I'm going to continue with the next color. Now I'm putting a third and final coat of the cedar color, which is the background color, over the words North Carolina. Everything that you see me painting has at least two coats rolled on and in the case of North Carolina here it has three coats brushed on. Next I'm painting the sun. The sky gets a two-tone treatment. The bottom part is a almost a white, it's a very pale blue, and the top is a darker blue and it graduates from the lighter to the darker blue. So to protect the yellow sun and the green mountains, I'm going to apply a vinyl stencil, like so, and peel off my transfer tape. And now this is ready to roll. I've got both colors on this roller. I don't know if you can see, but that's lighter and that's darker. So, tilting one end of the roller up to get the bottom half pretty much the white color, and then tilting it the other way to get the darker blue color. And then the sort of meeting in the middle. Go up and down to mix them a little bit. And there we go. Right. Now this vinyl stencil comes off. And now I'm going to paint the graduated green in here. So we need a stencil, stencils to protect both of those areas. One. And the other. The last color to go on is the dark green background and I'm going to tape off a few things that are not going to be dark green like the word North Carolina. So now everything gets rolled green except for this area right in here. Yeah. 
Now that I've slept and the paint has had time to set up, the vinyl will come off. And that's it. Just a little bit of touch-up.